Hey guys, this is Daniel Wex. This is my first video ever, so please comment below for for what I can do better. Okay, so today I am showing you how to cast 200 to 300 feet out wherever you're fishing with a fly. Today I have my rod that I bought myself, a Tiger reel from Walmart and Tiger rod. Shakespeare from Walmart. It's a combo. It was really cheap though. So I have about 17 to 20 inch line, 20 pound line, okay? So you can use whatever line you want. Um, right now I have a swivel at the very end of my line and then I have a bead to stop the swivels from hitting each other, from damaging the line. And then I have another swivel. Okay? And then I have a bobber. Three to five feet long uh, uh, line. And then I have a, another bead. And then I have a swivel. And then on the other side, I have a tied knot. You could do whatever you want. The swivel on both sides, the knot on both sides, or switch them. It's your choice. But um, And then I have, on the other side of the bobber, I have a another bead. You don't have to include that one, but it's just safe. Okay, so, for right now, and then, oh, I forgot. And then also I have a fly. This is, this is I made in Fly Club at school. And then I had a line. And then I have another um, loop at the end. Okay. So, and then, oh, I forgot. One last thing. The most important piece of all. The weight. I have a three, three ounce weight, which probably will get me out there. I haven't tested it yet, but... I, I tested it in my own pool, so, um, but I haven't casted it out, so I'll come back later and show you that, but right now, I will take that swivel, put this on the very end swivel, and snap that in, okay? So, now, oh shoot, I got it on the wrong one, darn it. Yeah, make sure not to do that. Alright, very end, not the one that moves, but, um, and then attach your bobber to the very end. Can I go shoot myself now? <laughs> 